Hey guys, welcome back. I'm the Bento Buster, and today I'm going to show you how to make some easy tiger toast. Growl! Using Vegemite. Vegemite is a yeast extract spread sold in Australia. It's made from leftover brewer's yeast, vegetables, and spices. The color is a very dark reddish brown, almost black. And it's one of the richest sources of vitamin B known to man. So if you need a vitamin B boost, this is your tonic. Now this stuff is extremely salty and an acquired taste. But believe me, once you're hooked, it's addictive. To Australians, a Vegemite sandwich is the equivalent of an American peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So if you can comprehend that, you can understand that it's a great comfort food for many people in the world. Okay, now to make tiger toast, you need a few simple things. You need some bread, butter, cheese, and some, bam, cutlery. Oh, and don't forget the Vegemite. Now the first step is to butter our bread. Now there are no hard and fast rules on what type of bread to use. Most people just use whatever they have in their kitchen. AKA white bread, but today I'm using some, what is this, wholemeal bread. And I chose that solely because it has a similar shading to a Tasmanian tiger. Chances are tiger toast is named after the Bengal tiger. But the extinct Tasmanian tiger did have stripes, so there you go and um, hey, I'm wearing stripes too by chance. <laughs> now if you're new to Vegemite, I guess the most important question is how much should I use? And the answer to that is, as little as possible, because all you need is just a smidgen. And that's because this is nothing like peanut butter or Nutella. It's Vegemite, guys. And trust me, it's potent in a good way. So the correct technique is to take a smidgen and smear it along that toast. With yeast extract spreads like Vegemite or its cousin Marmite, a little goes a long way. And once you're comfortable with the amount of smearing you've done, maybe you could add just a, another smidgen of smear. But just a smidgen, you hear me, okay? God, the smidgen of smear, that alliteration sounds like a Dire Straits song. It was a smidgen, the smidgen of smear. Blah, 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 weighing down south in Wellington. Okay, I'm sorry about that. Um, getting back to the Vegemite, as you can see, I've used hardly any. So this this little jar is gonna, gonna last me years. You know, if you look in any Aussies or Kiwis pantry, you probably find a jar of Vegemite or, or New Zealand's Marmite in there, and it's probably been there for about five years. And they're still chipping away at it on a daily basis. Yep, it's really good value for money. Okay, and I digress. Now while I've been plabbing on, I've cut the cheese into nice thick strips. And these strips will become stripes. So the next task is to place them on the bread and make them look like a tiger. Wow, look at that, an instant transformation. And there you go, that's like a real scary tiger. Grrr. Wow. Okay, so now I'm gonna pop it under the grill and give it a toasting. And after several minutes under the grill, it should look a little bit like this. Okay, so excuse me while I tuck into this with my coffee. Now, if you think tiger toast is cool, join me next week when I'm gonna attempt to make a Ned Kelly bobblehead doll. And all you need is a small can of baked beans, a BB gun, and a koala. By the way, I'm just joking. Mmm, savory, cheesy, buttery, and wholemealy. And I feel all that vitamin B killing all the bacteria in me now. Hey! <laughs> there really is something about Vegemite and toast. It really is a good pairing. If you've had Vegemite or New Zealand's Marmite, then you know what I'm talking about. If not, you're on your own. Ha <laughs> ha, you've got no idea, have you? Well, my recommendation is give it a try. I mean, it won't hurt, will it? The taste is hard to describe. It does not taste like yeast. It's savory and salty and mm, strong, but good, really, really good. This stuff is 100% umami. If you love the crispy bits on bacon, then you'll love this, but it doesn't taste like that, but it kind of does in the same way, if it makes any sense at all. So if you have any Vegemite or Marmite on hand, go ahead and make some Tiger Toast tomorrow. If not, how about stepping out of your comfort zone and trying some? For further info, check on the Amazon link below. Okay, catch you later. Bentabuster out.